Okay, we want to find the determine if this sum is convergent or if it's divergent. And if it is convergent, find the sum. Okay, so the first thing I want to do is remind you of the formula. Now notice that this formula is only true. So let me actually amend this. This is only true if the absolute value of R, which is your ratio, your constant, is less than one. So let's kind of include that in there. So now I'm looking at this A times R to the N. And here, everything is similar. N is starting at zero. Here, N is starting at zero. And we've got to figure out how this, these terms are equal to A times R to the N. And here's how we'll do it. So let A equal one. So we can rewrite this as the sum N equals zero to infinity of one. And then we've got three halves to the N. So we can see that one is A, which is our constant. And then R, the ratio, is three halves. Okay, so R is equal to three halves. So do you see that A is one, R is three halves. So now look, so since R is equal to three halves, the absolute value of R is not less than one, right? Because absolute value of R is just gonna be three halves, which is bigger than one. So our series diverges. And we would put here, converge, diverge, it diverges. That's it.